So and you, you did mention the 20 years, 20 years. Uh, you've been there for a, a, a huge amount of that time. Of <laughs> yeah. I've seen of those. So I've what? seen a lot of ups and downs. <laughs> yes. And, you know, different regimes for impact as well, different people in charge and different positions. So, Gail, I kind of, I know this is a broad question and I don't know yeah. if it's hard to answer, but what have you thought about the evolution of impact wrestling and where it started and how it got to the point where we are at right now? Yeah, I mean, it's been a roller coaster, but I feel like wrestling in general is a roller coaster, to be honest. And I've seen, like you said, many managements change and, you know, who's in charge. And uh, and we've always kind of been this little underdog, right? And trying to prove to everyone that there were the best wrestling product on TV. And right now, uh, we went through a little bit of a negative period where I think fans just wanted to hate us. And now we feel like it's really turned around. I get comments all the time from people. I respect their opinions, you know, from fans to people in the business. You guys have the best product on TV right now. You know, the storylines, the characters, the rest, you know, the wrestlers have so much talent and everyone's being utilized. You know, you really look at that roster and you go, okay, everyone's part of this show. It's incredible. Um, and we really do just come together because we feel like the underdogs sometimes times to produce i mean i think in my opinion uh 2022 we've been killing every pay-per-view consistently so i feel like slime reversary is going to be no different